What is up guys and welcome back. Right, ghosts. We have fucking ghosts in this game, which is just absolutely amazing. One of the creepiest things I've ever experienced. Now, as you can see, there is a storm in full effect and I'm going to show the map in a second where I am. But I came back to Volga to do some proper searching and I'm going to do a guide on all the upgrades, including the suppressor for the Kalash, which I didn't collect before, which is so damn useful. But uh, back to the ghost. So we're on an island right down the south, southeast down there. Now I can only assume that you have to come here when it's stormy because I left the hut and I came back, went back inside and it was sunny and there was nothing. So have a look at this. The first time I went in, there was tons of stuff. Now this is the second time when I went out, came back to do the guide and went back inside and there wasn't a single soul. <laughs> Funny I used the word soul there, but um, there wasn't a single ghost at all. And I was like, ah shit, did I miss it? But I did have the footage from before, so what I'm going to do now is switch to that footage and check this out. Be sure to do it with headphones if you're going to come here because, oh my god. <sighs> yeah, put your mask on. You shine your light, you can actually see the outlines of them. It's absolutely brilliant. We see their last minutes I don't know but there's tons there's about 15 of them I didn't even realize they went down the passage behind me as well and also walking around the outside of the hut one of the guys walks out of the doorway or well, that break in that hole over there at least and uh, walks around the hut but these people are praying it's probably that person right there but crazy 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 creepy but fucking awesome as well. I love it. This game is just blowing my mind. Just like Red Dead. So I switch to a different footage now. And I get a different angle from the other side. But you can't stay here for very long because you will end up as one of them. But I highly recommend coming to check this out on your own. Make sure you've got those headphones pumping loud. The storm and the rain and the everything is just such a cool combination with this. And I have come here before, but... Uh, there were definitely no ghosts, I probably would have noticed. But like I was saying before, I came back in after the storm had, had subsided and there was nothing. Yeah, get those headphones on, listen to what they're saying. You can hear them murmuring, it's fucking crazy. Never mind the giant catfish outside hunting me still. Look at that, you can see the shadows, it's absolutely cool, man. You can see this guy actually coughing. I mean, the detail is mad. That guy down there, he's the one that kind of walks outside, as you can see there. And you get a whole lot in this shot right here. And I thought I'd get another angle from this side. Um, and the radiation is much harder here, much more, more severe, I think. Now, in there is death. I did jump in there to have a look. It's so cool how the light actually accentuates the silhouettes. It's crazy, man. And it's not actually the ghosts making the shadows, it's just the imprints. It's mad. It's like they're actually there, but they're not. I don't know. Maybe I'm overselling it, but I, I thoroughly enjoyed finding this little secret. I want to call it a secret because I didn't find it the first time I was here, so there must be some conditions that have to be met. And I'm going to go with the massive storm. There was a massive cloud. As you can see, more down the passageway here. So yeah, guys, I strongly recommend coming to check this little village out here, or this little hut. It's absolutely crazy insane. So I want to say thanks so much for watching, guys, and I want to catch you on the next one.